lot from the first year that you can carry over to this year and just to keep uh, continue growing? Um, I kind of, well, everyone's telling me I'm not a rookie anymore, but I'm <laughs> kind of just approaching using that same mindset that I had last year as this year. I'm just always trying to learn, always trying to get better, and I have just great vets around me, great great players around me that I can always learn from. So I'm just just trying to use that same approach as I was last year. I'm, I kind of, even though I'm not I'm in year two, but I'm, right, I'm uh, thinking that I'm, I'm still a rookie. And you've been the old rookie team last year. Now what part of your game do you work on next and build on as you continue to go forward? Yeah, I'm just trying to stay aggressive, and that doesn't necessarily mean scoring. Just trying to not only make plays for myself, but make plays for others as well. Um, my teammates, like, I mean, Elena, uh, Taylor. I mean, Taylor is, is coming back, but I mean, I could just just stay aggressive and and being a threat on offense and also defense as well. When I asked Coach, you know, who he had his eyes on the most coming to training camp, who he wanted to see the most, he said you. He wanted to see what you what changes you, how, how you had grown as a professional overseas. So, what was your overseas experience like, and mm -hmm. what did you learn from that? It was it was great. I mean, I, I just wanted to. It was my role overseas was a little bit different than I was here. Um, so like I was, it actually would, would help me because I had to be really aggressive over there, and that's one of the things I wanted to work on this year, just being aggressive and and being able to make plays for other people, and also just being a, um, a disturbance on the defensive end as well. You are in your year, uh, your year two experience as a WNBA player, but uh, you know, last year you were kind of the younger ones, and then now this year you have people that are younger than you. Have you talked to them? Yeah, I have. Um, I just told them like just a year ago I was just like you guys. So the questions that you guys have now, I probably still have them till this day. And I told them that I'm, I'm honestly just like them. I'm still trying to learn just like them. Um, like I said, it was just a year ago that I was in their shoes. But I mean, they're they're grasping things and they're and they're working hard. And that's that's basically all you have to do, honestly. What do you like with this year's team? And everybody feels pretty confident that we've talked to so far. Yeah. And it just there must be a really good feeling about where you went last year and what you can do this year. Right. I'm I'm very excited. I mean, we were fairly a very new team last year. I mean, this was our first time all playing together last year. And I mean, we have year two under our belt. We're working hard. Like, a lot of people were working hard in the off season. A lot of people had great seasons overseas. And just just coming in this training camp, working it, working out, I mean, working hard and just putting it all together. I'm really excited for the season coming up. Can I ask you, what's it like to have a couple Duke players, a couple um, Maryland players? Are we having fun with that? Yeah, I mean, a little bit. We don't really, we haven't really talked much about it. I mean, it was, it's only, what, day two, day three coming up. But, I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure it'll come out soon enough. <laughs> <laughs> a lot of players, as you mentioned, have been here working hard. Everybody's been raving about Tiana. What did, yeah. did you? Uh, <laughs> She's literally as skinny as I am. I keep telling her that because everyone makes it funny how skinny I am. But she is, she looks great. She looks great. I mean, the way she's moving, the way she's playing, I mean, big year for her. Big year for her. Anybody else standing out? Um, I, honestly, we all have just been just been grinding it out. It's good to see Asia back in the building over there. Um, but, I mean, we've all been, been, been playing really well. I mean, TRP, like, she, I heard her talking about her three-point shooting. She came in and... And coach has expanded the three-point line to the NBA line, and she's knocking it down. So just seeing how her her growth is going, Tiana. I mean, Elena's gonna be Elena. I mean, <laughs> she's just great all around. So like I said, I'm excited about the season coming up. You had about I think three fourths of the way through the season. You got a lot more playing time last year for a few games, and then. You know, of course, during the playoffs, that, yeah. that went down a little right, bit. Right. But, you know, Coach has really been on, on you about getting, mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm sure you've, you've heard this, yeah. <laughs> yeah. about yes. being assertive. I know that was yeah. a tough transition for you uh -huh. to not be the person uh -huh. out there. So when are you on? When are you off? But yeah. you, you feel more comfortable with that going into this year? Yeah, definitely. I'm just, just trying to have a presence. Yeah. And, and that doesn't, like... That's why I love basketball so much is you can do so many things without just scoring just and having a presence. And especially on a team like this, everyone can do so many different things and everyone can be a threat. And, and that's what makes the game easy. So like I said, I just want to have my presence felt and just, and just stay aggressive. Expectations into this year probably higher than they were last year after how far you made it. What did you take from that playoff run that you guys could all use uh, this year and potentially another one? Yeah, I mean, I think last year was just like, Honestly, I didn't, we didn't look at it like a baseline, but like I said, it was our first year playing together. So, I mean, we see what we can do in that short amount of time with what we had. And, I mean, now it's, now it's year two. And we, I think, I mean, we're just only going to get stronger from there. So, like I said, it should, it should be a very good year.